Clayton Carter, a 51-year-old resident of West Goshen, Pennsylvania, was accused of shooting and killing his neighbor after a long-running dispute. Carter allegedly shot his neighbor, Brooks Jennings, 51, twice in the head with a semi-automatic handgun as the two faced off in Jennings' yard. Carter was arrested and taken into custody, and was later charged with first-degree murder and related offenses. Chester County District Attorney Tom Hogan commented on the matter and said, This killing leaves a wife without a husband, a little boy without a father, and a community in shock and mourning. Hogan added that the shooting death of Jennings was the culmination of a long-running feud between the two neighbors. It was reported that prior to the fatal shooting, local law enforcement were called to break up a verbal argument between the two men. Several hours after the police left they were called again after Carter and Jennings were said to be involved in property spotlight dispute. Jennings was said to be shining a flashlight in Carter's face, and in retaliation, Carter allegedly shined his vehicle's high beams into the windows of the Jennings home. According to NBC Philadelphia, Carter told law enforcement that Jennings had tried to attack him with a knife and his reported shooting was in self-defense. My client is claiming self-defense and justification, Carter's attorney, Terence Marlowe, said in a statement. Mr. Jennings was tormenting him and attacked him with a knife. Philly.com reported that the feud between the two men resulted in over 70 calls to police over the last five years. World Net Daily reported that Carter's yard was filled with anti-Trump signs, and noted that Carter had a criminal record dating back nearly two decades for violence-related offenses. Jennings, a former member of the Chester County Republican Committee, leaves behind a nine-year-old son and wife.